Do you want to up your email marketing game by adding an animated GIF to your emails? Well, in this video, I'll be sharing how to create a custom animated GIF using Canva in less than two minutes. So let's get into it. Hello and welcome to my channel. I'm Kate Emily. I'm a brand and content strategist and I love helping small business owners just like you build their brands online. So if you're totally new to email marketing or you're wanting to give your emails a bit of a revamp, then go and check out my Email Like a Boss email marketing templates. These are the email copy you need for your welcome emails, nurture sequences, sales funnels, um, as well as email newsletters. And it's gonna help you to create emails that are so well written that your audience is going to want to engage with. So go and check out the link in my bio to find out more about these copy and paste templates. But in this video, I'm going to be sharing exactly how to create an animated GIF using Canva. And it will add that little spiffy element that you need to create better engagement on your emails. So why do GIFs get better engagement? Well, they add a bit of movement, some personality, and they make it look super professional as well. So let's get into the tutorial. All right, so first up, we jump into Canva, make sure you're logged in, and they've actually got the animated social media GIFs available straight away. So we'll just click on that. They show a bunch of different options. There's so many different designs and different aesthetics. I wouldn't take the text too literally because you can add whatever you want in. However, you wanna just pay attention to what these little animations are doing and if it's relevant to what you want in your GIF. I'm gonna choose this one because this is a really good one for a uh, sales promotion. So I would say, say this is a fashion brand, I would say 20% oops, 20% off today only. Something like that. I'd upload a picture of my particular product, um, but then you just go download video. So literally this is a five second video for social media. However, I'm gonna show you how to create a GIF out of it that you can put directly in your email so it plays automatically. So now I want you to head over to easygif.com and go to video to GIF. Choose the file. And then upload video. And convert to GIF. So go save. And then I'll just jump into my email marketing platform that I use. So I use Flowdesk for all my email marketing campaigns. I would highly recommend them. And I do have a link to a special discount. If you would like that, go and check out the description below. Okay, so these are all their templates. Just so you're aware, a GIF can't go into a template on Flowdesk. However, you can do a start from scratch or add your GIF later on in your template. So we'll just say GIF template. So you write a bit of copy, then we'll add our GIF as a image. And there we go, our GIF is in our email. So if you just wanna see what it looks like, desktop and mobile, with a GIF like this one, I probably would just use that and then put a button say, um, buy now or something like that. And then that way it's just creating a really strong call to action. And that's literally it. No need for professional software developers or designers to help you out with this one. It's three steps and takes you less than two minutes. But if you're wanting to create beautifully designed emails, then go and check out Flowdesk. I've got a link in the description below for a half price membership forever. So that's a real goodie if you're wanting to branch away from something like MailChimp or ConvertKit, which have very limited designs. So that's it for me for today. This is a nice, quick, short little video, and I hope you got a lot out of it and you're gonna be able to add customized gifts to your emails. But if you love this video, give it a thumbs up and please consider subscribing to my channel if you are new here because I share a lot of tutorials like this one, which are little digital marketing tips and tricks. So 
subscribe and I'll see you back here next time with another video I know you're gonna love but bye for now